back till I can't no more. I got the horses in the back, horse stock is attached. Head is mad at black. Freaking finally! You won't believe it. I got my computer back if you can see I have my mouse. And my keyboard. Oh, here. I got it all back, so now you're finally seeing my intro. And you're probably wondering. Here, I'm going to take a picture before I start the video. And I'm going to show you what it is. It's called a light for my computer. Scrolling around my computer right here. Top of the wood. Probably if I just rip some of it off here. Rip some of this off here. You can see that right there. See part of that right there. That's part of it. That is part of the light. Get right back on my computer. Pretty sticky. So yeah, I um, hope you guys. Well, it's not over yet. I'm just telling you that I got my freaking intro back. Well, see, so, yeah. Get right into the video. It's gonna be Opera GX browser that I finally got. I finally figured out of. So yeah, peace. Well, first the intro then. Please close all Chrome windows. No, Chrome isn't even open. I was going to uninstall Chrome, and well, didn't work. Well, frick Chrome now because I got Opera. I got Opera. Where is it? Opera GX is a gaming browser. There it is, Opera GX browser. It's one of the coolest browsers I've ever seen in my life. Is it fits my gaming, my gaming habit. It's so cool. I'm gonna pin this to my taskbar. I'm gonna unpin this from my taskbar. My background. Oh, I'm going to switch to some pin this as well. There we go. And I won't ever use this either. Neither of this. There we go. Here it is, guys. If I just click new tab, I got I imported all of my bookmarks from Chrome. It makes such a cool noise. If you can hear it. Click on YouTube. It takes me straight directly to YouTube. It's got that cool sidebar. Click Twitch. And yeah. Messenger. Oh. Nope. A messenger got your download folder. I don't even know what this cube does. Extension. He's got settings here. It's a very, very cool browser. I found this on the web. Actually, I found it from a YouTube video. Um, from Crazy Craft. There's an old channel that doesn't post anymore, I don't think. You got advanced settings. You can change your browser to Google, search Yahoo, DuckDuckGo, Amazon, Bing, Wikipedia, why would you want Wikipedia or Amazon? Like Google. Uh, you can use uh, you can it comes with its own built-in freaking web ad blocker block ads and serve the web I have that on frick it comes with I forgot another setting you can manage you can do this um 
I see I've imported all of my um, bookmarks from Chrome. You can install um, other things. I, I rated Opera browser. You can do all this user interface. You can change the location. As for each file, yeah, I want that on. Didn't never notice that features. It has its own built-in VPN. Battery saver, instant search. Currency, you can do that too. And reset the settings. Look at this, if I just go here. You got all these uh, things here. You can add YouTube, Reddit, Discord. I haven't, um, it, I haven't signed Reddit or Discord yet. Yes, I have it. I have a Discord. I'm showing in. This is one of the coolest browsers ever. GX Control. You can network limiter. You can turn on network limiter. I turn on Rambler CPU limiter. Right now it's using 7% of my CPU too. Well, well I have a Core i3 3220. You can change, it's only you're not even using Gigabyte. So I just turn this on if I can, I can. CPU limiter. 100 max, what if I just put it down to 25 max? 100 max. The U limiter off. I can change RAM limiter. I can change it all the way down to one gigabyte. If I just go into task manager really quickly. I so you're not even using 500 megabytes. It's actually, oh, I haven't used 700. That's my video recorder right there, Brandy Cam. It's not even using, um, not even, oh. I was gonna say it's not even using, um, 1% of CPU. But anyway, it's probably because I got a really good CPU. It's not that good, it's not an i9. It's nothing, it's not i3, is one of those old ones. Um, it's the sickest browser I've ever seen. It's the coolest browser I've ever seen. I love the GX control part. Like if you were recording or something, you could change it down to like a little bit. But the bad thing is you can actually slow down your browser. Browser. You do that. Which is pretty bad. That's why I keep them off. Basic controls. Privacy and security. I can get this on my phone. I don't even know if I spelled off or right. I probably didn't. There's an Opera Mini browser for tablets and telephones. Opera GX is a browser for games currently available on Microsoft Windows. So it's saying basically, no, I can't get it on my phone, which is pretty sad. Um, probably couldn't run it on this anyway. I got four gigs of RAM on my computer, which is actually not that. I could probably, two more gigabytes of RAM in this phone, and I probably would have been able to run games that my computer could run. Yeah, because my phone has two gigabytes of RAM installed. 
Go to downloads folder here, no downloads files. Sorry about that, guys. But yeah, this is going to be it for this video. just wanted to show you guys this browser. If you want to learn more about this browser, I'll leave a link in the description. Tab menu. What is this? Oh. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Until next time. Peace.